First, the money ran out. Then, the police ran out. Then, the government ran out. Then, the food ran out. Even the ammo ran out. Then, the people ran out. And now, I walk alone. What will you do when the ammo runs out? You need a tool that is powerful, stealthy, and accurate. I've used every possible hunting tool and can confidently say that the crossbow is my favorite choice. Obviously crossbows aren't ideal for running and gunning, and we are not talking about tactical applications here. We're talking about hunting for food and maybe some light duty self-defense. Recall the second rule of Zombieland is the double tap. This could be difficult with a standard crossbow because of the painfully slow reloading process. Today we're going to check out the next evolution of crossbows that allows the user to shoot two crossbows with insane power and deadly accuracy on a platform which is built to last damn near forever. This is the ultimate survival crossbow. Today we're going to talk about the Excalibur Twin Strike Recurve Crossbow. Recurve crossbows may well be the ultimate prepper hunting tool. Compound crossbows, in my opinion, have too many moving parts, and they require a bow press and a lot of skill to maintain, and I can't even imagine how hard it would be to engineer a string for one of these things. Now, I have reviewed an auto-loading multi-arrow crossbow before, but never one that had the bone-crushing power of a real crossbow. Excalibur has recently released this twin strike crossbow. It's a uniquely powerful double shot crossbow that has many advantages over a single shot. In today's video, we're going to talk about the pros and cons of this bow. But before we do that, let's talk about some advantages and disadvantages of crossbows. The advantages of crossbows. They are quieter than firearms. Gunshots are very loud and will draw the attention of every cannibal within earshot. Crossbows are far more stealthy. Crossbows have reusable ammunition, and contrary to traditional and compound bows, the shorter arrows and bolts won't break as easily on impact. They are powerful and deliver slightly more kinetic energy than a compound bow. Crossbows are the most accurate of these string projectile weapons. There is also less of a learning curve than a compound or traditional bow. You basically get it sighted in with a scope, account for the elevation drop and distance, and you go get yourself some meat. Well, it's not quite that easy, but if you're an experienced hunter, it certainly can be. Recurve crossbows like the Twin Strike and all of Excalibur's bows for that matter don't have any elaborate pulley systems that are going to be prone to breaking like compound bows or crossbows, but they can achieve a very similar amount of power. It would be much easier to engineer a string for a recurve crossbow than a compound bow. Compound bows may have some advantages like being easier to cock and slightly more powerful, but they do have these many drawbacks. Crossbows are better than traditional bows because you can attach other accessories. They are better than compound bows because they are easier to maintain. They are also more intimidating than one of these traditional or compound style bows. In addition, no license is required in many countries around the world to own one. They are a lot more legal and they are a lot easier to get. They're also a lot easier to train on because they are a lot quieter. Cross bolts are smaller than conventional arrows, thus you are able to carry more. Because the crossbow stock is similar to that of a firearm, this allows you to shoot in a prone or lying down position, and you can even use a bipod or a monopod to steady your shot. Another great benefit of crossbows and bows in particular is that in most places the hunting seasons are longer. The biggest cons of a crossbow are obvious. They're big, they're unwieldy, they're heavy, and they typically cost a lot of money. Now the Twin Strike crossbow in my opinion is nothing short of amazing. They're made in Canada and they're one of the most reputable brands in the industry, renowned for their toughness. My first ever crossbow was from Excalibur and that thing could survive World War 3 if it had to. 
Even if the Twin Strike is out of your price range, all of their bows, including their entry level ones, will be with you for a lifetime. Prices on their bows can range from $500 all the way up to $2,500. Now let's talk about the Twin Strike. Now you would think that the ability to shoot two high powered bolts out of a recurve crossbow platform would have some compromises in power, weight and accuracy. But in my testing, that simply was not true. Setting up this bow is incredibly easy. There's a few screws and you're provided all the tools you need it to put it together. This also makes it easy to be taken down in a pinch if you're wanting to transport it out in a more portable configuration. Sighting the bow in, however, may take a minute if you are a novice. But once again, the great thing about sighting in a crossbow is you can use all of the support systems that you would to try to sight in your rifle. Sighting in also requires shooting the top arrow only as there is a very small deviation from the target on the bottom arrow but not much, an inch over 100 yards. I didn't realize this until around 10 shots when I just couldn't seem to dial in the elevation. Duh. You still do get a very tight grouping. This bow can shoot up to speeds of 360 feet per second, which is mid to high range for compound crossbows and powerful enough to take down anything that walks in North America. This bow does have a 358 pound draw weight, so unless you're Ronnie Coleman, you're probably going to benefit from the built-in crank system. This works exceptionally well, especially after you get used to it, and it can be removed with ease. Now the bow weighs around 8 pounds. For a crossbow, this isn't that bad. It's heavy, but it's a manageable weight. The stock, as you can see here, is an over-molded bullpup design. It's incredibly comfortable and easy to shoot. You'll want to shoot this bow all day long. Now you can see here that there's two four pound frictionless triggers. The front trigger fires the top arrow and the rear fires the bottom. You can theoretically do both at once, but I personally haven't tried this yet. Excalibur also has a cease fire technology, which ensures that there's not going to be any dry fires. One thing you absolutely need to be focused on when shooting a crossbow is safety. In my personal opinion, in inexperienced hands, crossbows can even be more dangerous than firearms. So you need to treat them with absolute respect and make sure that every time you load it and shoot it, you are following the proper procedure. The position of the arrows is in an over-under rail system. It's very intuitive and easy to load. The draw length of this bow is 14 inches and the overall length is 33 inches. Within the Twin Strike bow kit, you're going to get an Overwatch illuminated scope which allows for 2 to 5 times magnification. This is one of the better scopes that I've had on my crossbows. I do own a compound crossbow and a entry level Excalibur crossbow and I can confidently say that I really love this scope. The clarity that you get, you get the scope mount and the rings, you get RED suppressors, you get a dual fire decocking aid, you also get this arrow quiver and a bracket. It also comes with four quill arrows with the proprietary Rhino knocks that are gonna be compatible with the dry fire system and you're gonna get your four 100 gram field points, which you're obviously gonna to wanna to change out for broadheads if you're hunting. Now there are some traditionalists who like to poke fun at this bow. They make all sorts of criticisms which in my mind lack any substance. One of the stupid claims that I've heard is that people are going to be more careless with their initial shot because now they have a backup shot. To me this is a silly argument. Any rifle hunter is not going to squander away their first shot just because they have more in the magazine. Other criticisms are that if people miss, they may take a second more poorly placed shot which may only wound the deer and leave it permanently maimed. Again, apparently these people have never heard of hunting with semi-auto rifles before. I think a lot of these criticisms stem from the fact that the Twin Strike does come with a very high price point. Considering that you're getting the only double barrel crossbow in existence, which is built by one of the most reputable brands in the world and built to last a lifetime aka the ultimate apocalypse crossbow, $2,000 for this bow to an experienced gun collector is probably going to be a drop in the bucket. That doesn't mean it's going to be everybody's cup of tea, and I would certainly not recommend it for a beginner, but it's nice to know that there's still companies out there that are trying to innovate on a recurve crossbow platform. So to all of the disgruntled purists out there who are just mad because they don't own one, just because you don't want to buy something doesn't mean that it's not useful or doesn't have a practical utility. 
If you could have the choice between having one shots or two shots with very little compromise in terms of the accuracy, the weight, and the power of the bow, who in their right mind wouldn't want that? It's like those guys I hear who say, I would never want useless muscles like those meatheads at the gym. Yeah, sure you wouldn't, buddy. Sure you wouldn't. All in all, this is an amazing platform, but it is incredibly expensive. If something like this is well out of your price range, I still would recommend looking at entry-level crossbows. One of the best things about crossbows is the expanded hunting season. You're going to be able to hunt before all the rifles come out. And because crossbows are far more accurate and require less skill to use than compound bows, it will increase your odds of success even more. If you want more information on these crossbows, check out the links in the description below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. If you want more information on crossbows or the targets used in this video, check out the links in the description below. Thanks for watching. Canadian Prepper out. The best way to support this channel is to support yourself by gearing up at CanadianPreparedness.com. The best quality products at the best prices. Use discount code SURVIVALPREPPER, all caps, all one word, for 10% off. Thanks for watching. Stay safe.